what is going on my crypto fam rj here and in today's video we are going to go ahead and show you guys how to update your new metamask to have the new dark mode feature now before we get started if you guys haven't already please consider smashing that like button down below for the youtube algorithm also if you guys are new to this channel please consider subscribing and hitting that notification bell so you guys are notified every single time i upload new content we do have a quick video here just to show you guys how to do the update so that you guys have that sick sick dark mode feature on metamask and it's much easier on the eyes so without further ado let's dive right on in to the flight deck all right everyone so i'm going to show you guys this really quick so if you look here you'll see that the metamask oh it's not going to show it's actually not going to show because it's coming up as a different window so let's go ahead and head over to twitter really quickly here and let's go to my profile and you will see that when you open metamask it is this new dark feature and if we go to metamask's official twitter site you will see that yes you can now rest your eyes because dark mode for metamask extension is here so here's their dark mode feature again when i click on the metamask extension here when i click on it it doesn't open for privacy reasons i could share my entire screen but then i have to mess with the aspect ratio okay so to show you guys, I'm going to first show you how to do it on Brave Browser. If you guys don't have automatic updates enabled on your extension, you guys just have to go to uh, your Manage Extensions page, okay? Whether you're using Windows or MacBook, just go ahead and go into the uh, Manage Extensions. Or you can go to the URL brave colon slash slash extensions. Now here, you by default, developer mode is toggled off. So on the top right hand side, right under the magnifying glass, you'll see developer mode. So go ahead and toggle that on. And then you're going to go ahead and click on the MetaMask here where it says details. And then here, without this developer mode on the top right hand side up here, you won't have this update feature. OK, so what you want to do is you want to toggle that developer mode. And right here, you'll see load unpacked pack extension and then update. So you'll go ahead and hit update and it's going to go ahead and update you to the latest MetaMask version. All right. So if I click on update, you'll see on the bottom left hand side updating and then you'll see extension updated. And then the next thing I'm going to show you guys is how to do it on Google Chrome. So here we are on Google Chrome. Same exact thing. You're going to go ahead and whether you're on Windows or Mac, just go ahead and go into your manage extension site for Chrome. If you need the URL, it is Chrome colon slash slash extensions. All right. And then same thing here, you'll find your MetaMask and you'll hit details. And then by default, your developer mode on the top right hand side is toggled off. So you wouldn't have that update feature. So what you do is you just toggle developer mode. And then on the left hand side here, you will see update. So click on update. And then on the bottom left, you'll see updating. And then of course you will eventually see extension updated. Now, the last thing you guys have to do once your MetaMask extension is actually up to date. Again, I can't show you on mine because for privacy reasons, it never, I can click on the MetaMask extension here, but it's not going to show anything on the screen. So we can follow along on this actual article here where it says when dark mode, now dark mode. So if we scroll down here, once your MetaMask extension has been updated, the next thing you have to do is you guys just have to click on the circle on the top right hand side and then click on settings. Once you click on settings, you're going to see an option on the bottom called experimental. And what you guys are seeing in this screen right here, you'll see experimental and then you will scroll down and you will see theme. And under theme, you'll select dark mode. So you'll have dark, light, and then system. So you will select dark mode, and then it'll enable your MetaMask dark mode feature. Okay, so again, just a quick recap. Once you've updated the extension on MetaMask, you'll just open MetaMask. You'll click on the circle on the top right-hand side. You're going to click on settings. And then you're going to click on experimental, which will bring you to this screenshot under experimental. You'll just scroll down under theme where it says choose your preferred MetaMask theme and you will select dark mode. And then finally, you will have the freshest dark mode themed MetaMask on your computer. So again, a very quick and easy tutorial video on how to update your MetaMask, much, much easier on the eyes and obviously much more preferable than the white, in my opinion. But if you guys did enjoy that video, do me a favor and please consider smashing that like button down below for the YouTube algorithm. Also, if you guys are new to this channel, please consider subscribing and hitting that notification bell so you guys are notified every single time I upload new content. If you guys have any other questions, just please post them in the comment section below. Life is too freaking short, so eat some delicious food, drink some delicious drinks, 
do some good in the world, spread some positive vibes, and I'm going to see everyone on the next crypto video next time.